Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Reagan. if you are new here. So I have a very special video today. So this video is sponsored by Blissoma. So they are a skincare company based in St. Louis, Missouri. So, or Missouri, depends on where you're from. So I became interested in Blissoma whenever we received this product in our Petty Board box. It's the Refine Clay Renewal Treatment Mask. I really have liked this. I'll talk about it in a little bit, but that's how I found out about them and that was the first product I used and I was pretty impressed with it. And so I did a little bit of research on them and I found some kind of interesting stuff. So Blissoma actually is founded by or was founded by an herbal chemist. Her name is, I wrote it down, Julie Longyear. So I thought that was really cool. And one of the things that really struck me on their website, especially I know that a lot of you have asked me about clean skincare that doesn't use essential oils, things like that. So I was just looking on their website researching and what they say is that Blissoma products are made with nutritious raw whole plant extracts that are offer concentrated nutrition to skin. Our botanicals are sourced from organic farms around the world and our formulations are biodegradable. We even know botanical allergens to better help our plant sensitive crew out there. So a lot of their stuff isn't fragranced with an essential oil or a fragrance. The fragrance comes from the botanics that they're using. So it's cool. Let's roll into the products I've been using. This is my, it's morning. So this is my morning skincare routine. I've been using this stuff for about three weeks. I took it with me to Kansas and then I used it for five days before that. And then I've been back for three. So yeah, about two and a half weeks. Let's just roll in and start. So the first product that I'm going to be using is the Free Rejuvenating Herbal Gel Cleanser and Makeup Remover. This product is $39 for four ounces. And one thing that's really cool about their website is they say how much quantity you get for those four ounces. So the quantity of this product provides enough product to wash your face twice daily for over one month. So I'm just going to pump this into my hand. The packaging's really nice. It's really sturdy. It's not plastic, it's glass, and it's also opaque, which is important, I have learned, with skincare because the light does affect the ingredients. One thing that's also cool is they tell you the temperature to store your products at right here. So that was just something interesting that I haven't seen on a lot of products. So this is a very nice cleanser. They say about the scent that it smells pleasantly only of the natural base ingredients. And the natural base ingredients are soap bark and organic oils. The scent that I'm getting from this, and just what I would compare this to, is strawberry Laffy Taffy. And laugh if you may, that's just how I feel about it. So I'm just massaging this upward into my skin. I have used this at night and it works great at removing makeup. Just a little something. Check out my Instagram today. I will have a story up about my nighttime routine using some of these products. So me removing my makeup with this will be on there. It has worked really well at that. So the main ingredients are soap bark and then they do have some organic sunflower oil. So it just really does work nicely at breaking down makeup, which I thought was interesting because that's really rare and just a cleanser. It's really nice because it's gentle. That's what I've enjoyed about it, but it also works effectively. And then this cleanser is actually good for all skin types, all ages, and it doesn't leave my skin really taut or dry, but it does leave it very nicely cleansed. It, again, it's good for morning and evening. That's what I like about it because usually I also, I have a very complex skincare routine. So usually what I do is I use one cleanser in the morning that's a pretty light cleanser. And then in the evening I'll do oil cleanse, maybe some micellar water around the eyes if I've done really heavy eye makeup, and then I'll do a cleanser. Well, that's, that's like four products right there. So this product did everything for me, truly. Again, head over to the Insta stories if you're curious about how it removes makeup because that information will be there. So the next product I've been using is the Serene Sacred Waters Tonique. So this is $32 for four ounces, so it provides enough for about two months of use. So one thing that's kind of cool about their cleanser is you don't necessarily need a toner after it. Because of that acidic pH, you're barrier isn't going to be disrupted. So 
we don't necessarily or I don't necessarily need to use a toner right now. I just like to. It's just part of my routine. That's what I like. But the cleanser doesn't leave my skin super stripped. I could just go into the next phase if I wanted to, but I do really like this product and I want to talk about it. I like this because the mister is really nice. The scent smells like clove to me. It does not have clove in it, but just that, again, you know how the cleanser smell like strawberry Laffy Taffy to me? That's what this product smells like, even though they don't use clove. Actually, the main ingredients, I wrote them out, are organic holy basil hydrosol, organic rose hydrosol, organic Ganesian root, which contains an acid that brightens skin, MSM, which is actually a sulfur-based nutrient and sulfur diminishes redness and all of that. The interesting thing is, is if anyone's used a sulfur-based product, they smell, this does not smell at all. So kind of interesting formulation. And then they also use organic go-to cola and organic hops. And these ingredients actually contain antioxidants, which help with environmental stressors like pollution and stuff. So it's a really nice product. I've really liked it. I like the scent of it. The packaging is nice. It has this gold. It's a little bit different than the cleanser packaging. And it also still says on here the temperature to store the product. So they have these nice glass bottles, which again, I know a lot of people will appreciate and like because it's something I like. And then just the branding is really pretty too. And then the last product I've been using as part of my routine is the Phototonic Light Shifting Solution. This is an SPF 25 facial sunscreen and moisturizer. So this one is their pricier product. It's $52 for 1.6 ounces. One thing that was interesting about this, whenever I put it on my hand, it has this peachish color. I do, I get pretty heavy with this. I do use three pumps because I do from my neck to my forehead basically. And then I use a different body sunscreen for my body during the day. This is packed with antioxidants and it also has this special compound in it because I saw this peach shade and I thought that my skin would not look good with this because I thought it was some sort of a found, tinted foundation product or something and it's not. It's actually a red algae and this red algae actually contains a lot of antioxidants so it's a really great product for sun protection and I just have really enjoyed it. This has just a really light scent. I, I have nothing to compare it to. I don't have anything cute to compare it to. Nothing irritating or nothing that's causing me any scent issues. But yeah, I think that my skin looks really great with this product. I'm going to zoom you guys in so you can see how everything looks because it really did not tint my skin and I thought it was going to, but it doesn't. And I'm happy about that because I actually prefer a product, a separate sunscreen from my foundation or base product. That's just something that I've found. I will always use a sunscreen product and then a base on top, even if they both have SPF in them, just that's what I'm comfortable with. So just zooming you guys in so you can see. I have a few, I have a zit here because it's hormonal time of the month. I did break out right here. And then I have a bug bite right here. So that kind of sucks. But my skin looks really plump and hydrated. That sunscreen actually does have niacinamide in it, which does help keep the skin pretty plumped and hydrated. So that's kind of the theme of this line for me, or at least the products that I chose from this line, is that they really do a nice job at hydration. And that's what I'm looking for in the summer because I'm not using anything active and I'm just trying to keep going what I already have. All righty, y'all. Thank you so much to Blissoma for sponsoring this and for making some great products. I really have liked their products and I thought they were amazing. And I wanted to share with you guys because I've been using them. I think they're a great summer line. And if you're looking for something pretty simplistic and pretty affordable. Nothing I used was uber pricey, especially for the quantity that I got. So I just think it's a great brand to look into because they have some great stuff going on. Alrighty y'all, thanks so much for sticking around to the very end and I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day or evening wherever you are in the world.